Hello YouTube and welcome once again to another instalment from The Domain. You join us today on The Domain sofa yeah. for an, a rather exciting unboxing. It is a, a rather exciting unboxing. It's the Lad and Dad special back again after our viral success from 2020. How does it feel that, that our last video has 41,000 views? It feels great, Simon. Yeah. <laughs> I feel more important than Kate Bush. <laughs> no one will know who that is. Well, they will because she's number one now after Stranger Things. Oh, yeah. That's right, yeah. No, when you said Kate Bush, I immediately thought you meant some some obscure folk artist <laughs> who plays at small venues. Right, so uh, what have you got for us today, I've Dad? been investing, Simon, in signature sets. Well, I'll tell the backstory. Dad approached me uh, the other day and said, um, what mega blocks can I invest in? Because to be fair, every single time I come home, which, you know, I've been away from England for six years, every time I come back to England, I buy and I sell Halo Mega Blocks. And the price is going up and up and up. It is a good question. What should you invest in? And I always try and tell people on my channel there are some very key things to invest in, particularly named characters like the Master Chief, any of Alpha 9, any of, uh, uh, well, certainly any of Noble Team. You've seen that new Falcon that, with yes. all, all six Noble Team members. I always think the best vehicles to invest in, Warthogs, Pelicans, sometimes Mongooses, but, well, Phantoms, Warthogs, and Pelicans. They're the number ones. They never go down in value, particularly green ones. And we've got the Pelican inbound. You so spoil the surprise. <laughs> I was going to open it. Well, no, say, okay. Look, Simon, this is a Pelican inbound. <laughs> all right, what do, what do you have in here, Dad? Oh, that was an easy open. It was an easy open. Whoa, whoa, what's that? Whoa, can you get it out? I'm ready to There's a pelican inbound. Oh no. It was a good fit. It's a good fit, that, yeah. <laughs> well, this was another It's gone one. back in. This is another unboxing. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. Which didn't go according to plan. That's aggressively tight, isn't it? Hey, hey! Whoa! What have we got here? What's that, Jono? That's a Pelican inbound. It's actually a two-in-one. Very iconic packaging, it's I think. It's a two-in-one in that you can build this... Firebase. So I thought you could build the Firebase... And the Pelican. And the Pelican. No. But you can't. You've no. got to choose. Yeah, and also, I mean, this Firebase is phenomenal. I would really like to build this, but the instruction manual is only for the Pelican. If you want to build the Firebase, you have to get the instruction manual online. Oh, well. One of the main things I'm always campaigning for in Halo Mega Blocks is Mega to introduce more structures and more diorama building materials, more Firebases. So this is right up our alley. So if you wanted to build both, what would you have to do, Simon? Buy two Pelicans. Buy and... two Pelicans? <laughs> well, funny you should say that. <laughs> well, we'll get to that point, but um, Mega is quite crafty. Do you know what these are? No. They're called Hunters, Let Go Alone. And Hunters in all the Halo games travel in pairs. That's they're, a hunter. They're pack brothers, and when you kill one of them, the other one becomes really aggressive and tries to kill you even more. Mega are smart because they release the Pelican with only one of the two Hunters. So if you buy two Pelicans, you'll have both of the Hunters together, and you'll, you'll be able to do the two-in-one build as well. And this is actually kind of like a three-in-one because the pelican, for the first time ever, opens up. So these are the two sides of the pelican. They snap together to make the full Whoa. pelican and you can go inside the pelican. Because there's a lot of uh, important events in Halo Infinite that happen inside the pelican. For example, this is a recreation of a moment in Halo Infinite. Yeah, and it also comes with a forklift. You need to show them the forklift. Yeah, right. They can't see it. There's the forklift. Comes with a forklift. Forklifts are quite popular in Halo. You could drive them in some of the games. And yeah, it's highly detailed. It mm. comes with, uh, the Pelican pilot. Basically in Halo Infinite, um, in the opening cutscene of the game, you're defeated and then you're floating through space and this guy rescues you. Everyone calls him Bro Hammer in the community. A Pelican, Master Chief and Bro Hammer, otherwise known as the pilot. That's the Pelican inbound. The fourth ever Pelican to be made by Halo Mega Bloks. What did you say about uh, Pack Brothers? It would be nice if we had two hunters to, to hunt together, could, wouldn't well, it? Well, more importantly, you could build a base and the Pelican if only you had two. So, Whoa. direct. <laughs> direct from Mega, Mega, we have something else. Now, even more backstory to this one. Um, you know, my dad was interested in buying more than one Pelican, but we didn't get round to it because the price of Pelicans actually shot up. We got that one for retail down there, like $120. Oh, wait, 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 wait,
ruined the surprise. Oh. We got that one for $120. We went on the, the Amazon listing yesterday, didn't we? And we noticed, which was very interesting, I don't know why they did this, Mega have replaced that packaging with the brand new purple design Mega packaging. What? I know, I know, it's wild. That was very exciting. Wait, 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 wait. So that was very exciting because we don't actually know, like the Pelican was meant to be uh, only released two years ago. And then Halo Infinite was delayed by a year, the game. The Pelican was kind of, it was kind of weird because when the game eventually came out, everybody wanted the Pelican, but it was out of production. So Mega brought it back, which we just, we bought the second wave of Pelicans. Yeah. But judging by the redesign with the purple packaging, there might be a third wave of Pelicans. The exciting thing will be if this is the redesigned Pelican packaging. We don't know yet. And it would be very exciting to see that because I've never seen that purple packaging. Hopefully, are you gonna ask for your money back if it's not the purple package? I am, yeah. Appetize this purple packaging. Let the camera see first, ready? Oh, no. Three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> are, you gonna get, are you gonna get your money back? It is nice to see official mega packaging though. Usually the, the proper cardboard packaging only ships with signature builds and occasionally full sets of Halo Heroes. It's not exactly the same. Is it not? Well, maybe it is. No, it isn't. No, look. I Whoa. Just lift up top. This is a Pelican variant. Can confirm. The Pelican, maybe this one is the original release and that's the re-release. Check the year on the box. This one is down at the bottom. This says 2020. Oh, so does that one. Very mysterious. Very mysterious. Yeah, so this one has a toggle on the bottom when that one does not. So when you open this one. Carefully. That's my investment. Well, Jono. Two Pelican inbounds. Two Pelican inbounds. Noble Six Originals will be jealous. Even the top top tabs there, you can see that orange section there where it doesn't doesn't have it here. So I'll be interested to see if slowly this is phased out for the purple design. And if so, you'll have to buy a third one. <laughs> so thank you very much for tuning in today, everybody. Thank you. Let us know if you want Block Dad to return to the channel. And what should we sign off with? Oh, well, it's obvious, isn't it? Well, we, we have we have new stuff now in the last two years. Now we say, as always, you stay awesome, you stay safe out there, folks. And the Hunter Ooh. picture is signing off. Whoa.